we're back. We've got the VR wagon. We've pulled the passenger seat out. Now the previous owners own their own nursery. So we're gonna find heaps of soil, dirt, God knows what else. So this is the carpet, the door trim. All right, so change plans. Front seat's ripped out. Back seat's been disconnected. All kinds of fun stuff. Flip it over. Oh yeah, it's a holographic. Haven't seen them since I was a kid. Now let's see uh, what mysteries and how much of a fortune we're going to find in the back seat and goings. I like this car, it's already giving you some money back. Fair bit of crap. Lots of churches. Good old shrapnel. Tobacco, hopefully it's just tobacco. A socket. Yeah, there's no sockets. Well, no, that's not a socket. There's a socket here. Oh, that's a fucking That's a good one. Alright. Alright, so we've finished vacuuming the interior, or well, passenger side. I've switched the head over from the vacuum to the steam cleaning head. But before we do that, we're going to spray some of the kit interior cleaner and the VIP carpet and fabric cleaner on all these spots. And we're going to hit with this scrubbing brush, agitate as much of the dirt and soil and stains on the carpet as we can possibly get here is going to be interesting especially on the uh, driver's side but for now we're just going to focus here so yeah i'm gonna set everything up and cut back to it when we're scrubbing That sit for a minute or two. Place this up and out of the way. Then we're going to start just scrubbing. Doesn't have to be perfect, just enough to agitate. So, I'm going to show you how it looks now, just over one quick pass. Obviously, we haven't done the whole side. Just focused in the um, passenger footwell. Already a noticeable difference. We're gonna have to do maybe two more passes completely before it's 
at the point where my OCD will let me say, okay, it's done, but for now, there is still some stubborn stains, but I mean, compared to what it was before, it was like that. Quick recap, we've sprayed some more of the water from the steam cleaner on the front passenger footwell, so letting it soak. And while we're waiting for a few minutes, we're gonna leave the foam on the back, soaking in, hopefully doing its thing on some of these stains, because these two are putrid. We can hit that later, but this come up pretty good with just a quick scrub. So Dimitri's finished giving it its second and third pass. At the end of the day, it is Dimitri's car, not mine. So if he's happy with the end result, then that's where we're at. It is noticeably better than what it was before we started. So what do you reckon? It's good enough. Good enough? Next. Not keeping the car. That's a fair point too. Next, we're going to take the driver's seat out, hit the carpet, and then do both seats and the back seat. I'll cut back to it. This will get our ink, pasta, sore stains, the whole lot. But if it can't get out soil from a the nursery, there's something seriously wrong with it. Alright, so this is the passenger seat, the front seat, after being hit, what, twice? Two times. And now we've ripped out the driver's seat, sprayed some stuff on it so ignore the um, yeah, little marks. So now we're going to quickly vacuum this and then steam this.
shit. All right, so it's sat most of the day. We gave it a quick once over this morning and now I'll show you what it looks like. This is the passenger side. There is still some light stains and soiling. However, Dimmy said he's happy with it how it is. It's not a show car. It's just gonna be used as a daily to get to work. So no point in going full OCD on it. And this is the driver's side. One stain still there. With the here. Once we put the seats back in, we'll back it out and show you in the daylight. Seat come up a lot better than it was before. The stain all around here is completely gone. As for the color of the water in the steam cleaner or hot water extractor, there and yeah, there. All this gunk and muck was in the seats in the carpet. So all in all, that's a fair result. All right, so now that we've got some, some daylight, I will show you how the interior turned out. It's not 100% perfect. However, if he decides to sell it, we will hit it once more. But for now, as use as a daily, he's happy with it. Okay, so I was editing and realized I didn't film an outro for the video, so that's it for the interior clean for now, and thanks for hanging around, and I'll catch you on the next video. Have a good one, guys.